Yo guys, just real quick to the intro to this video. Hopefully you guys are having a fantastic day, fantastic night. Um, the intro into this video is kind of a little bit weird. I know I'm eating. I just want to make this quick little intro for you guys. That way you kind of understand what's going on. Um, I didn't really make the best intro, uh, nor did it have like the best quality. I know this isn't the best quality. Um, I'm not using my Logitech camera because that one's plugged into um, uh, my Xbox right now. Um, but I just wanted to tell you guys basically just an unboxing of the... Um, uh, the Acer Predator monitor, uh, two of them that I got, and I just wanted to, you know, unbox it and, you know, show you guys what comes into the box and the setup, and I think I actually also compared it to, um, my, uh, Vizio 24-inch monitor, um, that got a lot of views, so, um, really important video for most of you guys because it does have a lot of views, so I want to make sure you guys enjoy it, hopefully you do. Uh, but yeah, uh, just a quick little intro letting you guys know what's going on and uh, hope you guys enjoy and I will see you guys on the next video. Peace. Uh, but without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the same box, but this is for my mom's house. Um, really excited to get into it. more of a professional uh, look for say. Hopefully audio is good. Hopefully camera quality is good. Check, check, and uh, check. But I'm going to go ahead and stand up for this part. You're probably going to get more of this. Um... Let's go ahead and uh, you're going to see me cut off, but I think you'll be okay. Let's go ahead and slice this. going to go ahead and flip to that front camera. Try to reduce all the falling because with the back camera. Anyways, let's see. We've got our uh, digital cable for our graphics card. If we ever get a PC. Um, more PC cables. Power supply. Very important. Very, very important. And, uh, of course, manual. I love manuals. And a uh, HDMI cable. Cool, cool stuff. Uh, and then, so I learned that the easiest way is to go ahead and just... Put this bad boy down. Slide them on out. Yeah. Oh no. I don't like it. There we go. Ever so slightly. Almost there. Hold on. There we go. Oh no! Don't let that fall off. Oh, Jesus. We did it! Alright, cool, cool, cool. Now we have this giant box which we can get out of the way. Cool. Alright. Time for more cutting because we have the base right here. You guys can't see it, but you guys can. You're welcome. Um, let's see. Just simple tape. Uh, cool. Remove this. This thing is heavy. There. Cool. Cool. All right, for the main, main presentation. Gonna put these guys to the side. Oh my God, there's so much broken styrofoam. All right, you guys ready? Ta-da! Hope y'all enjoyed that. Um, this is the end of the video, have a good one. No, I'm kidding. Uh, let's see, so in case you guys are still wondering, this is the Acer uh, XB1 28 inch 4K UHD, um, you know, milli one millisecond response time monitor. Super duper good. I've already tried it at um, my dad's house with the other one. Of course, like I said, this is going to be the one for here. And then whenever I end up uh, moving out of one or the other houses, um, we're going to go ahead and have both of them as a dual or I may do that before and just say screw it um you know my dad he can get over himself 
so. All right, now that we have this guy, let's go ahead and flip him upside down and get him unwrapped. Ooh, clean. Clean, clean, clean. Very beautiful monitor. We're actually gonna go ahead and rip that on off. This little this tells me everything it's got. It's got NVIDIA G Sync UHD 4K millisecond response time. It has a vertical tilt, eye protectant, and eco display. 20 inch or 28 inch gaming monitor. Very, very cool stuff. And then I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the setup process because it's actually very, very simple. Let's go ahead and put this nicely down. Um, show you how this works. Simple. So much styrofoam all over the damn place, but whatever. Um, Boom, just like that. And then the stand part. It's got like a uh, metal flange here. All right, and then let's see, it's gonna... It's on there, cool. Tighten her on down. Cool. And then, oh man, got stuck right there for a second, but boom. There you go, guys. Nice little look. The monitor can be really tall, it can be really low. Um, you can tilt it up, down, your preference. Um, if you bring it all the way up, you can have it as a vertical monitor, or horizontal, whatever. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and move you guys over here. Let's see how I want you. That's cool. I like that. Cool, cool, cool. So you guys can see, and then I'll have my P or my Mac sitting right there. Um, but yeah, very, very cool. XB1. This is the xb 281 hk model just in case you guys are wondering not cheap so if you're on a budget or if you're on a budget then um probably not the monitor for you but um very very good i'm excited to get into it. it's hot in here i have to turn my fans on all right guys we're back so just to give you a quick comparison i'll do more of an in-depth video uh you know showing the between the two and i'll also do um a comparison between the uh, Skepter uh, TV slash monitor that I have compared to this with the other one that I'll be doing uh, here in the next two days or so <clears throat> but just to show you a quick comparison of how this looks this is a 1080p um, go ahead and just give you a rundown I'm just controlling with one hand but I'm kind of trying to show you guys and then uh, we'll go ahead and get this turned on, set up. So, quick uh, before and uh, after with the old and new. 
All right, guys, and now we're back. We got a new game loading up, but just to show you, so I, you know, if you remember seeing that before, and because of the game loading and whatnot. Oh! Gave out on me, but that's what that looks like. Super duper clean. Yeah. There we go. Pretty clean. Let me know what you guys think. Acer monitor better? Vizio monitor better? Which one do you think is better? 28, 24? Let me know in the comment section below. And uh, yeah, once again, if you guys plan on going to the other video, leave now and uh, go watch that one. Um, or you can tune in to the end of this. Guys, once again, if you enjoyed, please do leave a like. Any questions, comments, or concerns, you can always to drop that down in the comment section below. And if you're feeling it, <coughs> spooky. You can always hit that subscribe button. This guy's Uzi Boyle Central, and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Later, guys. Peace.